Yo, what's going on guys? Bobby here and today we got another great video for you guys. So yesterday we did Colts new star power. We spoke about it. Um, I got it in the shop. Again, we're not wasting any boxes on our star powers. And we kind of just talked about, you know, how effective it was, how it makes Colt a ton better. You know, he's super, super good now. And today I actually got Rosa star power in the shop. Now I already have Rosa 800. Um, as you guys can see, we've been grinding a little. We're currently 10th in the world. This is not going to be our grind season though. Um, if everything goes according to plan, next season is going to be the time when we push for number one in the world. Right now, I've kind of just been, you know, setting myself up, getting in a good position uh, so that I don't reset too low so I can achieve a good personal best. Um, but yeah, so we're going to uh, switch to the new star power. This is the first time we're ever trying it. So the star power is Thorny Gloves. Rose's Punch gains 200 damage during her super. Now, I don't think this is that good. It's just changing from 200 health uh, when she's inside of a bush. Um, I don't think it's going to help too much to be honest. We're going to have to see and find out. But I do think this is going to be one of the one of the bad star powers in the game, which to be honest, I'm perfectly fine with. Just because Rosa is, you know, Rosa's just, she's she's a god. And I don't want her to be any better. So thank god she's a, she doesn't have, you know, the greatest star power in the world. But with that being said, let's hop into the first game and let's test it out. Okay, so here we go into our first game. Now we're facing some good EU players. Um, so we're going to go onto the left side here. Now we don't necessarily have to stay in the bushes before we kind of did because that was her star power. You know, she gets extra healing in the bushes, but now you, know, you don't really have to stay in there. But obviously just for the sneak element, it's obviously really good. Now the Shelly's probably super, super close to super. Uh, she just got it and she probably does have band-aid as well. So there's not much we're probably going to be able to do here. So we're just going to push up onto this Jesse over here. We're going to be able to pop that kill. We're just going to go down here. Now there is going to be a Shelly below Feli, so this is probably not... The best thing in the world. We're just going to pop our super here. So we're doing 844 damage per shot. So I actually took out the, uh, the Jesse really, really fast. A lot faster than we've seen before. Okay, so we're going to go down there. But yeah, it takes it down a lot faster than we did before. Um, I don't think it gives extra super recharge. So it actually might not help in that respect. Let's see if we can get this. Okay, yeah, we did a little bit of bait. We weren't able to get the kill. Belly is going to go down. They do have a complete counter comp, so this is not looking very good for us. Hopefully, we can find a way to get back into this. But yeah, they do have a crazy, crazy counter comp. Uh, I don't want to pop my super because I don't want it to be wasted. We're going to move along over here. It looks like Tara is right beside having her super, or has it right now. Okay, so she was beside having it. I'm going to be able to get behind them, but there is a Shelly here, so I'm not going to be able to do much. I'm able to pick up one kill over there. I am in their spawn. Feli is going to be able to keep them tapped, so that's a really good sign. Shelly is going to pick up all of the uh, all of the power or the gems. I don't know. I was about to say power ups. Uh, so we're getting pretty close. We're actually going to be able to get the kill. Feli's going to use the super. I'm going to pick up all the gems and we're going to run away. Hopefully they're able to take out this Tara in here. Feli's going to be able to take it out. We're going to run away with ten. I mean, eleven gems, not ten gems. We're going to be able to take out this Jesse over here, or at least get it one shot. We're going to be able to take it out. It's going to be a Shelly over here. No issue. We got our super, and that is going to end the first game. It was pretty exciting. Uh, we were able to get the start, but yeah, so the, the start power is really good when it comes to like DPS from up close, but it doesn't really help you 90% of the time, and when you're already in that super and you have that ball, you're basically unstoppable already, so that extra 200 damage per punch really isn't the biggest deal in the world. Let's hop into the next game, and let's see if it actually makes a difference. So here we go into our next game, and again, we're facing a Shelly and a Jesse, but the summon said of the Tara, they got the Rosa. So we're going to get lane against the Rosa. With Rosa, it's basically whoever gets the first punch wins, and we're going to get that first punch off on this Rosa. So we're going to be able to get them down. We're going to pop our super, be able to get this Jesse as well. Uh, we're going to go down to the Shelly over here, but we did enough damage to where our teammate was able to get the kill. So it looks like the Shelly is now likely going to be on our lane, which obviously counters us. Yeah, it's looking like she's making her way over here. Oh, no, never mind. Instead, we got the Rosa. But I still think the Shelly is around here. Just because Second Best is shooting at that lane and he's not seeing anything or picking up on anything. So I'm going to be able to pop my super over here. Feli's going to give me that heal. I'm going to be able to hit a few times. I'm going to pop my super again. The Shelly is right over here, but won't be able to do too much. I'm going to go down. She's going to get her super back. But we did charge most of our super back, I believe. Okay, never mind. It's a little bit above one fourth. So as Jesse knows, we're here. There is a Shelly in the bush. 
Again, we're just gonna like start punching. We're probably gonna go down. There's nothing we can do there. Second best does have pull, so worst case scenario, second probably will be able to get a pull. We are also right beside our super. The Shelly is trying to sneak below us here. Second is going to be able to pick up a kill. Feli is going to be able to go near them from behind. I'm going to pop my super right over here. And we're going to get a few kills. I'm going to leave that gem over there for Feli just so I can continue being aggressive. Uh, I think I'm just going to let myself die. Okay, never mind. I'm going to pop this. Not that that helped at all. Five seconds left. I don't think the Shelly will be able to kill Feli. Maybe she'll get Band-Aid. I don't know. Wasn't able to. And that is going to end the second game. So again, it didn't really help us too much. Um, again, the, like, an additional 200 damage doesn't really help, but I prefer gaining 200 health every time I'm in grass because that's just constantly helping me and this is only helping me for a really small period of the game where I don't really need the help. So let's hop to the third game and again, let's see if we can find any, if we're actually getting any help from it or if it's just, you know, an unnecessary boost. Okay, so here we go into the next game, and we're facing literally triple counter. I didn't see if they had a mid Rosa, but we're facing a bull and a Shelly at least. Yeah, they do have a mid Rosa. So yeah, we picked up OG second, unfortunately, had to go. He's going to be playing Colt lane, which is very good here, especially with Colt's new star power. So Feli is going to be confronted by this Rosa over here. We're just going to destroy that Shelly that came near us, as well as the Rosa. We're going to be able to get the bull with a big big help from og and this is like this is crazy because you don't normally see a quilt on this map obviously um and it's kind of out of the ordinary and the one game og does decide to go cold he faces triple tank which is li literally like a counter to all the tanks as a cold so that's insane we're gonna pop our super over here we're gonna be able to get that kill on the shelly we're gonna pop our super again against this rose and we're gonna be able to pretty easily take it out so right now we do have a eight to nothing lead currently OG's doing a great job as he has range on all of them. We're going to be able to take out this Rosa super easily. I'm going to pop my super and just go straight towards this bull. OG's going to try and steal the kill, but Feli was able to get it. Um, but yeah, we're just tearing through this team. Um, Rosa, you know, I, don't, I haven't really seen a gain really. Her super doesn't really affect too much in my opinion. But we're going to play one more game. Hopefully this is going to be a little bit of a harder one. And we will see if... You know, we'll, we'll form the final opinion after this next and final game. So here we go into the final game, and again we're seeing a Shelly. So every single game we've seen a Shelly, just because this map is so overpowered for Rosa, it's unreal. But we're going to be able to just go straight through this one. There is likely going to be something here. We're just going to pop our super. Feli should be super close to his. Okay, he just got on that next one, but he wasn't able to hit it. Oh my god, OG just got the... <laughs> just got taken out. There might be a Shelly somewhere here. I wouldn't be surprised. Looks like OG is trying to switch lanes. Going to wait for this Frank to overcommit a bit. We're going to go right beside it. Going to pop the super. We're going to take him out super fast. We're not actually going to be able to take him out, but we're going to switch up our focus and go onto this Poco over here. We're going to pop our super... We're gonna be able to take it out, but we are gonna spawn, or the Shelly is gonna spawn literally right beside us, and it's just gonna be, it's just gonna be a huge, huge takeout. Um, we're not gonna be able to get out of there. So anyways, we're gonna go right back for this Frank. Let's see if we can bait it. Okay, we we're a little bit too close to bait the super, but really good heal over there by Feli. I'm gonna go to the side over here, pop my super, and hopefully we get enough health. Okay, so we're able to take it out, but again, getting that bush health, health might have been able to keep us alive. So I think I would have rather had the other super, or the other star power, my bad. Anyways, I'm going to try and target this Poco. I've been playing really aggressive just because I know Feli has his heal, so I'm able to move up. It looks like this Frank has given up at this point. I'm going to steal the kill from OG, and we're going to head back. Now, Feli's going to have 10, so we can go a little bit more aggro and have a little bit more fun uh, at the end of this game. But anyways, let's see if we can kill this Poco. We're going to be able to grab that kill. Oh, maybe not. Okay, so we're able to tie it. But anyways, that's going to end the game. So my final thoughts on the Rosa Star Power is that, you know, it's okay um, at best. I'd say if there were 27 Star Powers, and I haven't seen all of the Star Powers yet, all the new ones, but I put it somewhere in like the 23, 24 range. Maybe it can be honestly the worst one. It's definitely not that, it doesn't help that much. It's not that good, 
but obviously it does give a little bit of a boost, which is what the star power is supposed to be. So anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope you guys have the same opinion as me. And if not, just drop it in the comment section below. I think I'm going to be covering every single star power that enters the game, just so we could talk about, you know, which ones you want to buy if they appear in your shop and which ones you don't want to buy. Um, obviously for someone like me, it's a little bit different because I have a, a ton of coins. Right now I have 120,000. So I'm just going to buy whatever is in my shop. But for you guys, you know, if you guys are saving up, you don't have that much. Definitely picking and choosing is where you want to be. And I would not buy this one. So anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys want me to cover every single star power, just let me know in the comment section below. And I'll definitely get on that. But anyways, that's going to be it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed. Peace.